Using IBM Cognos Enterprise, you can perform basic and advanced what-if analyses. You can do this via a browser or on the desktop. In this demonstration, we'll show you how to perform what-if or scenario analysis using the write-back capabilities of IBM Cognos TM1. In our scenario, you'll use a web-based workspace to review product sales and contribution to net income for previous years and the upcoming projections for 2012. You notice that certain products are projected to perform poorly in 2012, so you access the IBM Cognos TM1 model where the projections are stored. Cognos TM1 is the IBM Enterprise Planning software for budgeting, forecasting, and analysis. Start by dragging the model onto the workspace. Using basic OLAP procedures, you can get further details on the problem. You see that increasing cost of goods is making the Alpha chip less profitable year over year. Earlier in the year, there had been discussion about replacing the Alpha product with an outsourced substitute, which may end up being more profitable than manufacturing the chip in-house. In order to evaluate some scenarios, the Cognos TM1 model needs to be updated. You can do the update using IBM Cognos Insight, IBM's personal analytics solution. Minimize the browser and access the Cognos TM1 model with a saved Cognos Insight workspace on the desktop. It contains the connection to the enterprise Cognos TM1 server. In the Products dimension, create the Alpha Product Substitute by duplicating that element of the dimension and then making the necessary substitutions. By drilling down onto the new element, you discover that the cost of the outsourced chip will be cheaper. You enter this change into the model by typing this value into the crosstab. We also know that selling general and administrative, or SGA, expenses will increase, so you change that as well. Notice that you can also perform write-back by interacting with the visualization. Leaving everything else constant for the time being, you drill back up and compare the two chips before finally committing the metadata and data changes. Back in the browser, all you need to do is refresh the web-based workspace to see the changes. Now that the model has been updated, you can evaluate the two different scenarios to see how this outsourced chip will affect the bottom line. Let's create two sandboxes, one for each scenario. Sandboxes let you compare different data and their dependent calculations. The first scenario is that the company continues to sell both chips. Let's assume that the projected quantity sold will be split evenly and that the SGA expenses will be halved. After recalculating, you can see the results of this scenario, which seem unfavorable. In the next scenario, you evaluate what happens if the company sells only the outsourced chip. Zero out the alpha chip and assume that you may be able to sell many more of these chips, especially if you can decrease the price while keeping SGA expenses constant. Although the best action is quite obvious in this case, you can still flip between sandboxes to compare the scenarios before committing the desired model scenario to the model. At this point, you can also refresh the entire workspace to reflect the product change. IBM Cognos Enterprise enables you to perform what-if analysis with new levels of responsiveness. Using what-if analysis, you can tie finance to operations to help uncover new business options, increase profits, and manage capital effectively. Learn more about how you can use Cognos TM1 and what-if analysis to facilitate planning, forecasting, and profitability analysis.